Hi, early learners. Look at this fun puzzle I have. It's in the shape of a ball. This part is blue, and this part is red. And there's holes for the shapes to go in. Let's take the shapes out and put it back together. Open. Shake, 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 shake. You have to shake it to get the pieces out. Wow, look at all my pieces. What color are they? They're yellow. Let's put them back. Let's start with this piece. This piece has a number one on it. One. The shape is a circle. Can you say circle? A circle is one curved line that touches. Now let's find the circle. Is this a circle? No. Is this a circle? No. Hmm, which one looks like a circle? Is this a circle? Yes, let's put it in. Let's do this one next. This has the number two on it. This shape, it looks like a triangle because it has three sides, but it's actually called a sector. This is a part of a circle. Let's find the shape that looks like a sector. Let's turn it over. Is this a sector? No. There it is. Put it in. What shape is next? Let's see, this shape has the number three on it. And let's count the sides. One, two, three. Three straight sides. And one, two, three three corners. That means this is a triangle. Can you say triangle? Yes, a triangle. The word tri means three, just like this has three sides. Now let's find the triangle. Hmm, we have to spin it around. I don't see it on the red side. Let's try the blue side. Is this a triangle? No. Sometimes you have to try it a few times to find it, but don't give up. You can do it. I see that this has three sides, but how can I fit it in? Oh, I have to turn it. Turn until it fits. We did it. Remember, never give up. Always keep trying. This shape has a number four on it. And let's count the sides. One, two, three, Four. Four sides that are all the same. That means this is a square. Can you say square? Great. Let's find the square. I'm spinning it. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. Square. Put it in. This shape has the number five on it. Let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five. It has five sides and it has one, two, three, four, five. Five corners. This is a pentagon. Can you say pentagon? Great. Let's find the pentagon. Is this a pentagon? No. Is this a pentagon? No. Hmm, where could that pentagon be? Is this it? Let's turn it around and try. Look, it does fit. Push it in. Remember, never give up. Always keep trying. This shape has the number six on it. It has a line under the circle part. That's how I know it's a six. Let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six sides, just like the number. A six-sided shape is called a hexagon. Can you say hexagon? Great. Let's see, I think the hexagon must be on the red side. Is this a hexagon? No. Is this a hexagon? No. Hmm, where could that hexagon be? This looks like it has six sides. Let's see, does it fit? Oh, it's not fitting in. How do I get it in? Oh, that's right, we don't give up. Hmm, 
Let's keep turning, turning, turning. Oh, look, now it fits. Put it in. It's getting full. This shape has the number seven on it. Let's count the sides. One, two, three, four. It has four sides. The sides are not the same size. These sides are parallel and these sides are at an angle. This shape is called a trapezoid. Can you say trapezoid? Yes, trapezoid. Let's find the trapezoid. Is this it? No. Is this it? Hmm, it kind of looks like it, but it's not fitting. What do we need to do? Oh, turn it around. Okay, I'm turning it. Does that fit? It still doesn't fit. Should I give up? No, we don't give up. We keep trying. I turned it one more time and look, it fits. We did it. Remember, mistakes are how we learn. Oh, this has the number eight. And let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's interesting. It has a lot of sides. This shape is called a cross or a plus. Let's find where the cross goes. Does it go here? No. Let's keep looking. I don't see it on the red side. Let's turn it over. Does it go here? No. Now that looks right. Get it in just right and push. This shape has the number nine. I see the line under the long part. That means it's a nine. And the shape is an oval. It has one curved line, but it's longer than a circle. It's an oval. Can you say oval? Oval. Let's find the oval. Is this the oval? No, that's a circle. Hmm. I don't see an oval on the blue side. Let's turn it over. There it is. Oval. Put it in. This is our last shape. This shape has the number 10 on it. And let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten sides. And this shape has a lot of points. Let's count the points. One, two, three, four, five. Five points. Do you know what shape has five points? A star, that's right. Like twinkle, twinkle, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder where you are. Where is that star? There it is. I see the star, but it's not fitting. What do I do? I turn it. Turn, turn, turn until it fits. Yay, it fit in the shape. We did all the shapes. Great job. Remember, always keep trying, never give up. Keep playing and I'll see you next time.